We're absolutely knackered. You can say fuck you know. No. Say it from the beginning. We are absolutely fuck. So excited. <laughs> I'm so frustrated this morning because I've been waking up with like a really itchy throat and then I've been waking up itching it with my tongue like that oh it's just so frustrating I'm gonna start going down and sorting my car out so I've got like roughly an hour to sort my car out and just get as much stuff in there as I can pack mum's car in as well oh my god I'm so tired <laughs> We have just managed to fit pretty much everything in the freaking car. Look, oh. Mum's just squeezing the last bits in. Right, Madre. <laughs> Mum's helping. She's doing a really good job. I've got all of the bags in my car. Enough room for me. Hi there. We're here. So I'm going to take you in. Welcome to my new home. <laughs> electric and the water the last people that i need to call is the council i'm gonna do that after but we've basically got a bit of a trek to get everything in where the car parking is you can't just go from the car park into the flat you've got to walk around and in so we're gonna do that first once everything's in i think me and mum are gonna go and get some food because it's a really nice day as well i don't think today i care about putting everything away mm -hmm. happy yeah, I'm happy. Good. I, I guess it still doesn't feel, I don't know. It just still doesn't feel weird. Real. It just, yeah. It still doesn't feel real. I feel like I'm just coming here for a weekend. <laughs> you know? Unpacking my stuff, I'm just sitting overnight. Yeah. Stuff. We're camping. I'll have to show you the camping later. Bedroom will probably be best because of all the windows in here. It's so bright in this room. It is so amazing. Yeah. 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 <laughs> Now we darlings really happy. I'm really happy. Are you sad? Yeah. Like you're starting to feel a little bit sad yeah. now. Yeah. That's why I want to get that stuff. Don't oh. stop me off. Oh, come <laughs> here. <laughs> oh, mum. Fill it up. Oh, fill it up. I'm very, very happy for you. Oh, that. thank you, mum. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> it's happy to tease. Yeah, I know. I know. We've got one more trip left to do one more trip from the car to here and then everything should be in then. Anything else up there since tomorrow. Oh, I've got to bring so oh, much stuff up tomorrow. I've got to bring so, so much up. Do that. Okay. Oh. It won't be really. It's just the planks of everything. We're absolutely knackered. You can say fucked, you know. No. We're yeah. fucked. Just say it. We're fucked. Say it from the beginning. We are absolutely fucked. <laughs> That's great. Mum's just Fuck having a chill. Finish. 
This is the only furniture I've actually got. Oh, the sofa is coming tomorrow, but it's been bagged. This is all the boxes. Got a couple of bits up there. Got some food. Got all this, this up here. Mum's stuff there. And this is basically all the stuff that I own. This is all my clothes. This is all shoes there. Oh, just loads of stuff. And then in here, what we're gonna sleep on tonight. So we've got our camp bed stuff here, and then this is the stuff that we're actually using. That's basically it, but we're knackered, aren't we? Yeah. So I'm gonna make a tea. I'm gonna have to find two mugs and some kitchen bits, which is right there. Yeah, look at that. So you need to know how to work that. Electric hob. So if you've got to clean this carpet, you don't need to use abrasives and stuff like that. You just need to wipe down some use it. Like she's using. Why don't you clean like the microwave? You need to make a bin. Bin. Oh my god. Just made the bed. Oh my god. <gasps> oh my word, it's so funny. It looks like we're in some sort of army barrack. <laughs> So Doesn't it? Really comfortable. Come on, get in with me. Oh, yeah, that's nice. <laughs> yeah. Oh, this is great, Mum. Night. Night, love. We're just gonna lie in the living room. Yeah, I know. <laughs> <laughs> gonna go for food now because we're retired and hungry. And then come back and just sleep, I think. <laughs> right. <laughs> See you soon in the moon. <laughs> Mum's got herself a shandy. She's got a little sausage roll there. I've got some bread. I've got some chips. Yummy. I'm gonna have a kombucha. You're all good, Mama. But safe. You got some chips. Sorry. You got one. really suffer and I honour my bleed, I love my bleed but today just it's not the day. <laughs> I don't know where I've been. Oh my god yes yes <sighs> I'm just sweating <laughs> my poor little womb well done for today you've done brilliantly today thank you so have you I'm just so grateful that you helped me so much I couldn't have done it without you here Oh, I was my best I'm not going to lie, I feel rough today. Oh, it's a struggle to just even do anything. No energy. That's what happens to me when I get my period. I've got three deliveries coming today. One's the sofa, one's the Wi-Fi, and one's the washing machine. So they're like the three main deliveries. I should have everything delivered by two o'clock, I would imagine. It's just a case of hanging out here until two. Once everything's been delivered, me and mum are gonna head back to my mum and dad's house, and I'm gonna stay there tonight, around two tomorrow, get up, load the van with my dad, but it's all furniture, and then drive here and then unload. I'm just hoping, fingers crossed, Excuse me. I'm hoping my period has subsided. I've actually come on early and I think it's because of stress. I'm excited for the beanbag so I just want to lie on it. That's that. So enjoy. Enjoy today. Enjoy today. That's what I'm trying to tell myself. So now I'm like, okay, I've got to try and do this. So we're gonna try and put this together. We'll we'll just we'll just do it. We'll just do it. We'll be fine. I'm just like, how 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 am I gonna do this? But I'll make it work. Excuse me. Oh. 
pillows from my bed on here make it look a little bit more like a normal sofa i just did a makeshift curtain it's one of my blankets on my bed just clipped it at the top i'm just making a tiny little loop it's not going to be a tight one so that should keep it in place probably won't do that that just looks like a lot of effort feeling so much better than i was this morning made the sofa up we've had the washing machine delivered and we've had the wi-fi installed so that should be up and running by tonight i've tidied the kitchen i'm still tidying <laughs> apparently um I've put my monitors up where I will probably have my desk and we've cleared my room out because that's where we're going to install all the furniture so I need it to be clear so we've just kind of got it ready for tomorrow. Nice and clean and tidy but it does look really cute in here. The kitchen, I've kind of put stuff away. I've put stuff up there. don't really think I'm going to keep it there to be honest but I just needed to put stuff places. This is kind of how it looks at the moment. It's looking much better because it's nice and tidy. I'll start putting this all away when I've actually built everything together once Dad's made up furniture for me and we're gonna move that over there. This room has just got everything in it. It's all empty again. Are you ready to go, Mum? Just got back about an hour and a half ago. I only just really come up to my room now. I'm gonna show you. This is what my room looks like right now. It's so weird. I'm exhausted. I'm looking forward to tomorrow in a way to get it done. I can't wait to just be in there and just be able to chill. But yeah, just so ready for it to be done. So friggin' ready. <laughs> I'll see you in the morning for round two. Oh. Oh. I slept so much better last night. I woke up a few times thinking that I was late and then I had a dream that it was 10 o'clock and dad walked in and was like, Lauren, it's 10. And I was like, oh no, I'm late. <laughs> Even though I'm not late. Anyways, let's sort this room out. <sighs> Me and my dad have come all the way up here now. We've got all the furniture in. It was actually a lot better than I thought it would be. I think I was dreading it because of how many trips me and mum had to do and it was just so much effort. But I wanna show you what the flat currently looks like right now. It is just a mess, but it's fine. Whilst my dad's building the furniture in my room, this unit to there, and I can then put some stuff in the cupboards and get that bit sorted. So it will get some of the boxes away and down. I'm gonna move my little desk here to that spot where that big unit is. So then I'll put my screens on top of that to just kind of get some things moving. And then once the furniture's built in my room, then I can actually start moving stuff in there as well. This is the kitchen currently. Proper mess. This is just the current situation. This is the spare room. And this is the hallway. Just see if I can get in there and get a sneak peek. You right there? Yeah. There he is, look. He's moving the footy and building the wardrobe right now. Yeah, that's the current situation. Dad is just cleaning out my windows because there is so many spiders stuck in the window crevices, like around the edges. Gone through all the paperwork stuff. So you can always, you know, count on your dad for doing that kind of stuff. It's the boring stuff, you know, but they like to do it. <laughs> He's getting all the spiders out of it for me. Oh gosh, I, do you know what? I couldn't have done that. I'm just all wetty when it comes to any bug related stuff. I just me out. I've always been afraid of spiders. My dad doesn't understand why I'm afraid of spiders. He doesn't get it. He's like, well, they're more afraid of you, which I totally understand, but it's just been built in me to be afraid of them. If any of you have brothers out there, your brothers would grab a spider and then pretend to throw it at you. And that would make you scared because you're like, oh my God, that's what he used to do as well. So we've actually pretty much set up most of this area. I'll show it better later. I'll show you in my room. This is how it's looking at the moment. Obviously, you know, this is not finished. I have to put all my stuff away still. It looks like a proper bedroom now, which is nice. There's still stuff everywhere. I still have so much to do. Tomorrow I've got a day off work. 
so hopefully I can just chill. It'll be just nice to get everything away in places where it needs to be. I'm probably gonna end up moving things around. Once I've got all my stuff out of that room and all my clothes away and all the boxes empty, I can really have a little play around with everything. I can start making that room look like a more habitable room as well, so I'm excited about that. Lighting is so good here, I love it. It's been really nice having my dad here and obviously I have my mum here the first night, so tonight is my first night sleeping here alone which is really interesting. <laughs> I think that's when everything will hit me. I'm starting to slowly feel it, but I think when I'm here on my own and I wake up here on my own, that's when I'll be like, oh fuck, this is actually happening, you know?